Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. And in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing second in for Mares. So if you do want to go and pick this card up and try him out for yourself, his price range on both Xbox One and PlayStation 4 is 10,500 to 200,000 coins. So getting to this guy's first pro now, what is his agility? This is also his key stat. This guy has 96 agility. So um, he is one of the most agile players on the whole of FIFA 18, and he is one of my favorite five star skillers um, as well as that he has a really really good dribbling um, I think his dribbling is 91 if I remember correctly you know so honestly insane dribbling insane agility all the things you basically need for a good five star skiller on a FIFA 18 and this guy just has it in an abundance he's absolutely insane and I would probably say he's in my top two favorite five star skillers of FIFA 18 along with Neymar and then the final pro I could find with this card was his curve. Now, I'm not really too sure if there's many curve goals in this video. I can't really remember. But when I was playing with him, you know, his long passing and his um, shots when, when you know, he performed them, they just seem to curve a lot, you know, the ball. So um, I can't remember again his in-game stat for his curve, but I'm pretty sure it is in the high 80s, if not low 90s. So he has 96 agility as his key stats. He has medium, medium work rates. What? Isn't really the best for a winger, but he seemed to be fine. You know, I didn't really seem to um, find his positioning bad for me. And then he has a five-star skill moves and a four-star weak foot. So he can also, you know, finish on that weaker right foot. So we get a really nice goal there with Mara's performance and really nice skill moves. And then go with the low-driven finish into the bottom corner. Now, I would definitely say this card is definitely um, much better than his previous in form and his normal card. It just feels so much smoother when scaling with. Even though his normal card is very good for scaling, this card is just on another level. It's, you know, up there with players like Neymar and Ronaldo when it does come to scaling. And again, look at that goal there. Crazy, crazy goal. Do some nice off-ball dribbling to a double-touch spin past the player. And then we just go with the low-driven finish again. And that's what I think you should do with this card when you're on the edge of the box or inside the box. Just take the low-driven finish because, you know, 9 out of 10 times, it just seems to go into the corner. And then the final goal we get there with Morris is, again, an absolutely crazy goal. We do a fake shot there. And we flick it over the defender with an Akacha flick. And then we smash it past the goalie. So, guys, this has been the player review. If you have enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.